Ladies and gentlemen, we have been working all day and now it's after work. I'm Joe. Welcome back to Nintendo Spotlight where every week games come out on the Nintendo eShop. I go through, see what's of interest, and today we have Okami HD for the Nintendo Switch. This got released on the PS4 and Xbox One previously, um, a couple months back, if, or maybe earlier this, yeah, earlier this year, right? We're only off by a few months on this one, I believe, and we're gonna, we're gonna check it out, see what it's like. I've never played an Okami game at all. I know there's this, there's one on, on the DS, right? DS or 3DS, I can't remember. And then, did they ever do an Okami 2? Someone correct me on that one. And, um, here we are, Okami HD. Okami, Okami, Okami. Yo, a real kitty. Oh, what up? <laughs> Welcome to the stream. I can't wait for that 800 lunch at Disney World, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Hideki Kamiya. Oh, really? He did the story? He did the story to this? Long, long ago, a tiny hamlet known as Kamiki laid nestled in a grove of proud and beautiful cherry blossoms. Each and every tree around the quiet burg was honored as a god. However, the village was not without its dark secrets. Oh, I like the cherry blossoms. Oh. To satiate the appetite of Orochi, a fearsome cave-dwelling beast, a young maiden was offered as a sacrifice at the annual festival. With a body like a mountain, body like a wonderland, and eight heads mounted on its on the neck and sides of tree trunks, its blood-red eyes alone were said to curse anyone who gazed into them. No one dared to disobey the horrific beasts. Beast. Right, Deuterino, it's gonna be great. <laughs> when the night of the sacrifice drew near, a mysterious white wolf appeared outside the village. This wolf, its coat as brilliant as snow, was dubbed Shiran Shiranui. The wolf kept a watchful eye on anyone who ventured outside the village and made a habit of patrolling the streets at night. People assumed the wolf to be a familiar of Or Orochi. One villager took it upon himself to face the fearsome Shiranui. Nui. Oh, excuse me. The warrior Nagi attempted many times to challenge the wolf. But his attempts were thwarted by Shiranui's swift movements. Good luck with your stream, yo, real kitty. Thank you for stopping by. Yo, can we get some love for, for kitty up in here? Show Kitty some love. Show what the after work, after work crew fam is about. Before long, the night of the accursed festival had arrived. A white plumed arrow heralded the coming sacrifice. Piercing through the sky, the arrow sunk its shaft squarely into the home of Nami, the village's most beautiful maiden. Nagi, harboring a secret love for Nami, was enraged by the sign. Determined to put an end to Orochi once and for all, Nagi traveled to the beast's cave. I can't, like, press A and skip this. I press A and, like, read just the text so I can keep going. <laughs> it doesn't allow it. The moon cave, a place as dark as evil itself, served as Orochi's home. As Nagi st stood bravely before the entrance, a beast appeared, eyes glowing crimson upon eight thrashing necks. Orochi stood tall before him, anxious for another sacrifice. Nagi leaped with incredible grace, swinging his blade valiantly. On and on he sliced well into the moonless night. But Orochi's hide was like steel. That booty of steel. The blade left nar nearly a scratch. That's a lot of heads. Is that a bell in the middle of the thing? At lo- <laughs> At long last, Nagi, his energy spent from the intense battle, dropped to his knees, fatigued and grasping for breath. He knew, hey, just like me, he knew was he was staring in the face of. It was then that the wolf appeared. As if to protect Nagi, it stood its ground before Orochi. 
in the darkness of the cave. The wolf's coat shone brilliantly. Alas, it was Shiranui, Nui, the wolf that dwelled outside the village. Bearing its fearsome claws, Shiranui leaped toward, toward Orochi. Orochi reared, reared its, I'm sorry, with the rolling R's here. It's reared its terrifying heads, readying its fangs for battle. The two beasts struggled wildly, thrashing into the darkness. Yo, Joe, gotta finish packing, so I'm gonna head out. See you next time. Yo, Purple, thank you for jumping in. Fam, can we get some love on the way? Yeah, for Purple Monkey 13. Have yourself a good night, fam. Have a good weekend. Mysterious and terrifying, the spectacle continued. Shirinui summoned gusts of divine wind to counter Orochi's flames. I played this a bit on Wii. On Wii, never beat it, dude. I whew, first time, first time here. As Orochi closed on Shirinui, sharpened claws, a, gallant, a, a gigantic tree suddenly sprouted forth, shielding the wolf. Shirinui fought, fought gallantly to gain the upper hand. However, Orochi, protected by a mystical power, was not easily bested. Shirinui, covered in gashes, majestic coat dyed crimson, stood exhausted before the mighty Orochi. But there is a game called A Copy Now. That's what I was talking about. That DS sequel. I wasn't sure if there was like a proper two after that. Okay, so it was just those two games. Gotcha. Orochi saw a chance to strike what would be the final blow, but Shirinui refused to give in. With its last ounce of strength, the majestic wolf gazed heavenward and unleashed a mighty howl. Suddenly, the black clouds overhead dissipated. The light from above glinted off Nagi's sword as a beacon of hope. I'm back with some burger kind. Ooh, Burger King. Oh, that Burger King, yeah. Guided by a sword, Nagi, who had been taking shelter in the shadows, stood proudly to face his adversary channeling all of his strength into his scarred and battered arms. He, le he leaped ferociously toward Orochi, his sword poised high, the golden sword danced in his hands like a puppet to on a string. One by one, Orochi's fearsome heads separated from their owner. Orochi's broken body collapsed in a lake of its own blood. In that instant, the curse that plagued the villagers was lifted. As the battle subsided, the sun shone once again in the sky. Shiranui had succumbed to Orochi's poison and struggled to breathe. Nagi scooped the beast into its arms and returned to Kamiki. When they reached the village, Shiranui was no longer moving. The village elder gently stroked the wolf's head. In response, Shiranui let out a hoarse and pitiful bark, <laughs> then closed its eyes and drift off as if into slumber. Peace had la at last returned to Kamiki village. In honor of Shiranui's heroic exploits, the villagers erected a shrine and placed the statue of the wolf within it. Aww. Nagi's sword was christened Sukuyomi and placed inside the moon cave. The villagers all looked forward to an age of endless peace. Until next time. However, this is not the end of the story. There's more to this tale than most people know. A uh, 100 years... Wow, so this is like Zelda. A 100 years passed since Nagi and Shirinui's ex heroic exploits. It happened so quickly that no one on the village even took to notice. Yo, they fought Dragon Ganon. Erected. <laughs> Ooh. Art style's cool. Uh-oh. Is this legendary sword? Is this Sukoyomi, the sword that banished the dreaded Orochi? No, it couldn't be. It's just legend, nothing but a fairy tale. <laughs> I'm sorry. Ah, oh, 
Uh, they unleashed the evil. Bro, that's like the Master Sword. Capcom allowed to get away with this? <laughs> Hello. He who seeks power, he who has broken my bonds. Speak the words I wish darkness unto the world. Utter that prayer unto me and unleash my power. Rip. I'm out. He's dipping out. Hard body. These vibrations. Good vibrations. Damn. Run, Forest. <laughs> as soon as this cutscene's over, I'm gonna jump back in chat. I see some stuff happening. I beat this on PS2 with my cousin, on the Wii with my ex-girlfriend, and twice on the Xbox HD release. This is hands down the best game ever. Wow. Damn, cool bat. That's awesome. Like, that's like, this is like your game. This is like, no, dude, every time this comes out, I'm gonna beat this game. That's awesome. Are you gonna pick it up on Switch, dude? A horrible tragedy st suddenly swept over the land. However, there was one village that seemed to escape the terrible curse. The tiny settlement of Kamiki Village enjoyed the protection of a sacred tree. It is here that the real story begins. Right. People should learn not to touch evil looking things. Um, please, sir, can you not touch that? Oh. Oh, hey. What sprite Sequoia? How troublesome. This is just like the ancient prophecy of doom. Doom Eternal. There's a tie-in. What has transpired to bring about such calamity? I must act quickly. There's no time to lose. My power is diminished over the over the years spent protecting this area. I don't have much time left in this world. Amaterasu, now is the time. We've never needed your power more. Shine your divine light upon this broken and polluted world. Let your heavenly rays become our hope as you got blah 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 blah. Gosh, <laughs> that murmur is like droning. Funny enough, I believe the last time I ate Burger King was over a year ago in Germany. Dang, Okami Amaterasu. Ah. Ah, such divine white light, such beauty and grace. The only one capable of such a wondrous spectacle is none other than our mother and the origin of all that is Amaterasu. How delightful to see that the savior whose brave sacrifice sealed, sealed away the de evil demon so many years ago has not changed one bit. She likes to keep her figure. Seeing you emerge after so many years spent as the statue brings happiness to my heart. Amaterasu, gaze above you and take in the condition of the sky. Okami was on DS, right? The sequel, right? And didn't didn't you you didn't play as Okami, right? You played as like a, a different dog, right? Like the, the the offspring or something like that. Since your untimely departure from our midst, the world has come to this devious and vicious beasts. They have ravaged our fine and bountiful country of Nippon. But never had the circumstances been worse. That they're at this very moment. Please, use your powers to banish the darkness and punish those who would do us harm. Hmm. What is this? Has something stolen its way into my robe? <laughs> Oh, uh, she's turning evil. Was that necessary? Who? What on earth? You again? 
What the hell is that? <laughs> Yo. Tell me this dude wasn't in between. Yo. Are you nuts? Boy, for a little thing, you sure make a big fuss. I was just trying to make the conversation a bit more interesting. That's all. Were you napping in my clothes again, Bug? I'm pretty sure that was translated for censor. It was necessary, Joe. Thick is always necessary. <laughs> Yo, freaking cool, that. I can't. I can't with you. <laughs> Bug, I told you a thousand times not to call me that. I'm a wandering artist. The name's Eason. Wandering artist Eason. I'll show you just how great I am, and I won't be long till you're bowing, be bowing before my great brush. Ah, so that's the dude that has the brush and why there's like painting things. Well, what do you think? Even cuter than the real thing, no? What's with you, furball? You look kind of down in the dumps. This is supposed to be Navi, but really talkative. And with a Brooklyn accent. <laughs> you look kind of familiar. Got it, you look just like that statue of Shivranui. Oi! Yo! She ate him! <laughs> what do you think you're doing? Are you crazy? A handsome guy like me should never be covered in wolf slobber. Ugh! You'll regret messing with the great Isun. Don't make me use my prize sword, Denkoma Denkomaru, against you. What's that growling sound? And why is it so dark anyway? Really? <gasps> oh, great god, Amaterasu. I've used all the power I have to protect Kamiki Village. The village lives on. Their spirits lie encased in my fruit. Cut it free, and the village will be reborn. I trust you. I know that you will lead, it, lead us down the right path. Only your awesome power can restore life to the world. The trees return to normal, huh? That Sequoia girl sure said some weird stuff. The village's spirits are being kept inside the fruit. That's the fruit that girl said that if you cut it down, the village will be restored. But it's awfully high up there. If you don't use some kind of special power, there's no way you're gonna reach it. This darkness is really getting to me. A lot can happen while you're while you're taking a nap. Yoink! There we go. Finally. One more. One more. Uh oh, what did you guys kill in Monster Hunter? Oh Draco, did you buy Monster Hunter PC? I'm 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 not gonna lie, I'm tempted. <laughs> if you guys play it on PC. Oh there we go. The text went a little faster there. How's this looking on your guys' end? I'm kind of curious. Ooh. And how's the game sound, more importantly? Is the game too low? And how's the game sound, more importantly? Is the game... Ooh. I'll raise it up just a smidge. Like one of these. Because it'll probably get louder. Alright, beat a chomp. Mm. Hold on! That's the origin mirror! They said once your reflection appears on its surface, your memories will be stir- Oh, it's a save point. Alright, alright, alright. Let's save. This morning, Toestra. Arc tempered Lion King, goddamn. Oh no, honey, no. We gotta fix that. <laughs> Oh, that is old school camera angle right there. Or I guess, I guess the, the invert. Uh, I need to invert that. Is that what I need to do? It's like left is left, right is right. Oh, I can't do that. Not with a game like this. Can I fix that? <laughs> like now? I can't fix that. Are you kidding me? Oh no. <laughs> this is. No, yeah, right is left. Oh, wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it is inverted. I need to convert it. You bust him. 
Yeah, left goes... Right goes left, left goes... Oh, God, no. Oh. There we go. Nah, I can bark. Oh, Christ. You can, but... Uh, but you can... Do controls, I think. That's what I was looking for, the controls, to change the freaking camera thing. Alright. We'll just get used to... It. Oh, man. Up and down has always never been a problem, regardless of whether it was down, down, up, up, or down, up, up, down. It's the left and the right that messes with me. Whoa, 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 hold it on there, Fairball. Well, get a load of that. That chest looks mighty tempting. Let's go check it out. Getting up that high ought to be a, be, a, be a piece of cake. Press B to jump. Then press B again to wall jump. And get up there and open the treasure. Yoink! I knew you could do it. They said good luck is found in high places, so keep your eyes peeled. We don't want to miss any treasure. There we go. Holy Bone S. Favorite snack restores three solar energies. Also, is my health, like, behind me? Is that why I can't see it now? Looks like the bridge is out. It shouldn't be so hard, I'm until also right? That's kinda long. Mind if I call you Abby? Listen, Abby. Ever oh, good brushwork has its own soul. At least they say that. Just watch. Take all day to explain. The picture's worth a thousand words, right? Oh, how am I gonna do this with the pro control? I should have picked Jokons, because you could probably move it around. Nice, huh? I've mastered called Rejuvenation. It's one of many brush techniques that use divine power. It's a brush god power that can be res that can restore broken and missing things. I practice I practice really hard to master this one technique. But there are thirteen. Each one is a power of one of the thirteen brush gods. Originally, all thirteen were a single powerful deity. When the deity died, its powers were split into three separate gods. The gods now dwell within the objects all around us. God or no god, how can anyone have the power to master all 13? So I'm assuming there's like 13 dungeons <laughs> in this game. Or something along those lines. Ah, okay, I can pull up my map that way. River of the Heavens. Uh, they, may, they mean the fabled Stardust River. But I sure don't see anything like that around here. It could be that little puddle over there, could it? Thirteen plus bosses. Hot dang. Hot dang. What's this, like a 30, 40 hour journey, I'd imagine? Wow, look at the stars twinkle! I haven't had such a beautiful nighttime sky in ages! Hey, look! Are those stars forming a pattern? Or is it just me? Hmm, there's one missing. Guess I'll just have to draw the missing star! Bah! Looks like I'm just not ready to draw missing stars. Press R to hold. And then why to draw? So we're spending a heck of a lot of time practicing that. Well, it's no use just sitting around thinking about it. Time the great this time the great Isun's gonna put everything he has into it. Alright, so now I'm actually moving it. Oh, tap Y. Whoops. Tap Y. My bad. No. Come on. Hello. Ah, why, well, if it isn't Mother Amaterasu, I apologize for not contacting you sooner during these long years. Having never forgotten you, 
I, Yomigami, God of Restoration, have eagerly awaited this day when we could meet again. While you were away, the thirteen spirits of the brush that you once possessed, including myself, have been scattered across this land of men and now lie in disarray. I became a constellation and managed to survive until now. The time has come for you to seek out and reunite all te techniques. Your power is what is needed to restore the dried riverbed of the heavens and renew the flow of stardust. My man has mad orbs on his hand. Oh, that was the Yamigami, the god of rejuvenation. Wait, so you have the power of rejuvenation now? Can you really use it to restore the river of heavens? That means you were as good as with a brush as yours truly. Nah, could it be true? Who else could master the incredible god technique? Oh man. Long game, especially if you're going for everything and reading all the dialogue. I, I can already see it now. I can already see it now. One tap would have been enough. Oh, well, I'm still learning. Don't berate me. <laughs> this is my first time playing it. <laughs> Alright, so here we go. Hold R, right? Whoa! The river is Stardust. So it really is. It must be the River of Heavens. But what I really want to know is who the heck drew the darn thing? Over here, is that what's happening? Nice. Let's do that. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's dope. That's dope. That's cool. That's neat. Look at that. Look at that. We're making things drawn. Obtain the astral pouch. Look what you found, Froball! This astral pouch here is amazing! It could swallow up lots of food! Then when it's full, it can revive its owner if he or she dies! Let's start feeding it with whatever food we can find. Oh man. Oh. Consumed apple, nectar filled. Okay, alright. Let's do this. Breaking all of these. Oh, and Yen is involved in- oh boy. We're gonna be buying upgrades at the Yazoo. Alright, let's get out of here. Whoa! <laughs> oh my goodness, welcome everybody. We're playing Okami on the Switch. We're gonna be switching over to State of Decay. About 10-15 minutes or so-ish. Oh, 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 Depending on how long it takes to get through this, uh, this bit here. Just want to do this little spotlight here. I, man. This is going to be one of those games where I was saying before, I think I, I don't know if I said it during this episode or if it was before we started recording for this episode, but, um, this will probably be one of those games that when I'm playing on stream, I'll probably be a little bit further ahead from when I was streaming it the last time because I, I want to I want to get back into playing games also like off camera as well so this will this will probably be one of those games that I could be like yo I want to enjoy some of it off camera and also stream it when I'm streaming of course if it's something like crazy juicy then I'll probably, you know, hold off until stream time so you guys can get, like, my full-on reactions. Okay, so if I hold Y, I can run. Is that what that is? I think so. Yo, but is that the quick of the strike? The strike of the quick. Strikingly quick. Quick strike. Fam, how you doing with that Joe after switch? What up, fam? How's the move going? I, are you are you fully moved in? Is this a legendary shrine? Must it be the cave of Nagi? Strike that is quick. 
The legendary hero Nagi is enshrined here. He vanquished evil a hundred years ago with the help of the white wolf Shiranui. First of the river of the heavens, first the river of the heavens and now this place. Where the heck are we, Furball? Boy, this place is a wreck. See? That sword's in really bad shape. The god sure didn't do much to protect this place. But yo, the shrine quick, what up fam? I'm assuming, no, no. It can't handle the brush, okay. We gotta draw it carefully, let's go. Oh, that's crazy. Wait, I can move the camera angle to exactly where I need it to be so I can draw? Oh, that's dope. Huh. That really was your brushwork all this time. How'd you get that so good? Exactly who are you anyway? Hey, there's another constellation. This one looks like a... Looks like a rat. <laughs> it is. Okay, cool. Oi. Oh, are we getting a sword right now? The Draco that is gone, Ariel. Wait, Ariel. <laughs> well, well, well. If it isn't a, if it isn't Mother Amaterasu, it's been a long time. But with all these monsters around, the only place I could hide was in this shrine, dedicated to the ancient heroes. If there's anything I can do to assist you in your endeavors, I'm at your service. Make good use of this sword, as it was designed to conquer evil. They're based on the Zodiac 12 animals. Huh. Like the... like the... Like the Chinese uh, uh, twelve animals, or like their like theirs? Um, what is it? Like their whole thing? The yeah, the Chin the Chinese zodiac, like the year of the dragon, the year of the the rat, the year of the goat, and all that. Stuff. Uh, is it goat? No, it's not goat. It's something else. You you know what I mean? Okay, it is awesome, awesome. Yo, the Almighty, thank you for that host, dude. Bam! It has been a minute. Master, the power slash technique. Wait a minute, if you're getting all these powers, then you're just like that Shivanui. You know, the wolf that who fought and died alongside the great Nagi. When Shivanui died, the wolf's powers were split into 13 brush gods. This is crazy, Shivanui Nui and Nagi. It's just like the legend. Well, anyway, I gotta, I've gotta see this power slash technique myself. How about showing your stuff on that boulder over there? Let me see you slice it in half, drawing a single line. I still won't believe it until I see it. You call that a line? Use the brush like a sword. Slice it with a stringle, single straight line. Yeah, I was like, which way you want me to slice it? <laughs> Not even in the same league as you. Guess I really overestimated my my pa myself. Hey, Furball. Hey, I mean, I'm a Tarasu. I've made up my mind. If you're Shirinui reborn, then that means you can master all 13 techniques, right? In that case, I think I'll tag along until I'm as good as you. Lucky you. Oi. Went into his ear. <laughs> it's no use trying to change my mind. There's no stopping me once I've made a decision. But enough about me. Now that you've mastered the power slash, you can cut that thing. Oh, the tree. That's right. So, can I jump down or no? Oh, we gotta go back. Oh, it's even giving me the waypoint. Oh, that's handy. So I can only slash like this? Oh, snap. I'm gonna shower because I finished a 13 hour day, then I'll tell you what's a holy crap, fam. Yo, go do that, go do that, fam. Go, you go, you go do that. Remember the time Strike said he needed to take a shower? What in the. Where'd they come from? Whatever, draw first and ask questions later, right? You know that divine instrument you have on your back? Well, press Y to use the power against it. 
Whoa! Look, Amy! Once you caught them off, girl, you didn't turn them black and white, then they're easy prep for your brush. Make nasty moves. Show me your moves. Boom. I feel like this will be ten times easier with the Jokons. I already feel it right now. Okay, that is very Devil May Cry there. Now I see what you're saying, Cool Bat, with that Devil May Cry reference. Which I mean, Hideki Kamiya. That's uh, writing this story. That it kind of makes it kind of makes sense. It's crazy. Oh, hello. No. <laughs> okay, I'll take it. Uh-oh, what happened there? Uh, no? Oh, no. What happened there? Thank you, Draco, if something did happen there. <laughs> I think I just completely missed something there. <laughs> My bad, y'all. I failed you. Oh my god. Yo, they actually worked on HD Rumble. Like you you can hear the like the footsteps rumbling in the in the pro controller. I like that. Wow. 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 Uh-oh. I love... Ah, there we go. And that's the peach I need to cut. There we go. Got him! This game looks very beautiful. Damn, this thing is vibrating city right now. Oh, no. Oh, that's what happened. <laughs> I didn't mean... I wanted to look at it. I didn't mean to put it back up. <laughs> Does that show up for everybody? Is that what happened? Yeah. Self-promoing is a no-no. <laughs> like that. Like hard-bodied self-promoing. Like that. <laughs> No, yeah, Draco, you done good. You done good. Oh, yeah, it still shows up as a deleted message. Okay, good. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna do one of these. Hold on. Boom. <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah. 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 That happened. <laughs> wow, the village has been restored! You done good, Draco. You, Draco, you done good. Ah! See, that's what happened. That's what happened, son. That's what happened! <laughs> Sequoia came through big time. She really was protecting the village. I, but I sure wish I could have spent some more time. You know what I mean? Yo, this guy. Yo, savage. But seriously, with monsters running all around and all, the village could still be in danger. Let's go see how they're doing down there. Uh-oh. Are you nuts? What do you think you're doing? Uh, I was just trying... What in the world? I don't remember the, there being a statue here, but whatever it is, let's go talk to the villagers. Do I have to paint them to life? No? Okay. 
Dog, dragon, rat, cat, ox, monkey, horse, root, ti tiger, tiger, uppercut. Keep climbing up then. Yes, I was born in the year of the dragon. I've got a bad feeling about this. Kamiki Village is supposed to be a fam famous for its scenic beauty. I wonder what's going on down there. Whoops. Ellipse. Oh, I wanna fly. Bam. There we go. Yo, strike quick, you bugging. Ladies and gentlemen, we've been working all day, so you know what time it is? Throw sure those switches that? up and shake them biddies. Yo, strike, you are insane. Fifteen hundred but dude, bro. Thank you. What? Yo, guys, show the man strike, show the man strike quick some love. Can we get some heart, some joy? Ev just throw everything in there. Throw, throw, throw your controllers at. Don't throw your controllers at him. Give him your controllers or something, dude. Thank you. What? And my apologies, strike. I didn't even do this earlier. My bad. My bad. But yo, guys, now following strike quick. Awesome variety streamer. He is every bit hilarious as the crap that I pull off over here on streams with my cringiness. What I do in cringe, he does in hilarity. So, you want to find someone that's legit funny, that's Strikewick. Awesome variety streamer. Fan. Thank you for that. Dude. You're crazy. You're crazy. Do I need to cut this? Oh, I'm onto something here. Is it this? This constellation here? Is that what I needed to do? Oh wait, can I take back stars? Cause I didn't realize you can just pop them anywhere. No. Oh boy. Yeah, let's get that out of there. Thank you. Okay, I think I see what I need. Oh man, these are like puzzles within itself. No. That's crazy. I thought I was going to the... Oh, you know what? Nope, that map right there. There we go. Just drop back down. Drop back down. Drop back down. <laughs> there we go. Oh, that was the other way. Okay. There we go. Whoopsies. You're cra no, you're crazy, dude. Seriously, thank you. Everyone's not in, uh, like a stone. It's like a stone color, gray. Huh? We'll save it. This happens when there's no mini map or way waypoint. The good old days of just trying to figure stuff out. Exactly. Exactly. Which I would like to do. <laughs> but they do have a map here, so this is kind of handy. Oh, hello. I'm sorry, am I dying? 
Or is that just rumbling out of fear? Man. This is out of control. I love it. I love it. Right, so that was that save point that's there. Statue year two. Looks like the villagers have been turned to stone or something. Oh, not again. There's one of those smaller monsters that are lurking about. A roar like that has got to belong to someone much bigger. Let's hurry up and find somebody with a pulse around here. Let's do it. But yeah, went into this apartment to clean it before I moved in, but found bed bugs and roaches, and I said, what? Dude, no! So what happens now? Oh, hello. So I really gotta play this like a Zelda game. That's what it comes down to. <laughs> With like, the hidden stuff. Everyone here is just perfectly fine a few hours ago. There's definitely something strange going on around here. We'll just back up. Why is this dark? Uh, maybe it's dark outside in village too. Let's find out let's find some high ground so we can take a look. Okay, now I have to go to that thing that we went up to before. Quick strike, quick and <laughs> Oh broken. Broken baby. Mm. Oh, he was talking. He was saying something. And there we go. Now we got to go all the way back up. Okay. To the way that I started originally. There we go. Yeah. Okay, cool. So if you let go of Y once you got that, then you're good. Nice. Back to that sacred deck we were before. Bedroom 750 square feet. All wood and balcony. $150 cheaper than the two bedroom. I move it on the 30th. Yo. Done? Done? Dope? This is bad. The sun's not even shining. It's a black night. Black as night as far as I know. No mini-map, no waypoint. See, you're getting ready for Dark Souls. <laughs> what do you- t I mean, there was- that- that arrow was totally pointing me in the direction, and my- L, L, my ZL button is the map. <laughs> Is it some kind of curse? Did a monster do this? It's not gonna stay like this forever, is it? If only the sun were out to light our way. If you could draw a circle in the sky, we'd have ourselves a sun. But I guess that'd be impossible, even for a god like you. Maybe we'd better seek out another brush god for help. Of course, if you had that kind of power from the start, that'd be a different story. Well, let's see. We brought the sun! What the? Come to think of it, your name is Amaterasu. That's the name of the sun god. So it followed that you had the sunrise technique from the start. With it, you could even turn night into day. Wow, you're no run-of-the-mill god, that's for sure. The, bl the flowing brushes like the music from the heavens. That's a line from one of my grandfather's poems. He felt a skilled artist was like a musician of shape and color. Since you're such a great artist yourself, why don't we name your brush work after the poem of his? It's called the Celestial Brush. After all, you built your brush did bring out the sun. Well, Amy, let's get back to the village. Gotta go see if the villagers are good. What kind of circle is that, Joe? Yo, it's called, you know, shapes. <laughs> Village elder, Mr. Orange. Why do you have a manhole cover? <laughs> Cover on your back? Wait, oh, <laughs> that's my shield, I think. That is cheating. It's not cheating. <laughs> the White Wolf, not the one who fought that terrible creature with the Nagi. You couldn't possibly be the legendary Shiridui. No, it can't be. That story's a hundred years old. <laughs> Still, you look like a, a lot like that statue, Shiranui. On the other hand, you don't look a quite as smart. Oh, savage. <laughs> oh, the man all on my back. Yo. I'm gonna use that for now on. 
No need to growl like that. Can you really understand what I'm saying? Well, I'm not one to mince words. I just state the facts. <laughs> uh oh. You ever got hit with a manhole cover? I. <laughs> Please no. What's this sudden chill down my spine? Here they come, furball. Those are the mo those are the monsters that have been plaguing these lands. They sneak into the villages and cause all sorts of trouble. Step aside, furball. This one's the job of my trusty sword, Denko Maru. Yo, yo, yo! She hit him with the old man. <laughs> Yo, there we go. Yo, this manhole is <laughs> crazy. Did I just blind the person? Woo! Oh, they're dead already. Obtained the demon fang. Fang forged in demonic hatred. Beautiful. Deadly. Yo, that's crazy. Oh my gosh. You know, I never even realized I didn't raise the volume this entire time on Strum. My bad, guys. There we go. I don't even know what that was, but I'm going to lower this down a bit. Like right there. Wow, you really get aggressive when you're mad, don't you? Hey, you got yourself some praise, and look! See how that dried up spring began flowing again? That's because ridden ri ri an area of monsters restores the god's power to the land people call it divine intervention. The more you restore the land to its natural beauty, the more praise you get. It's the source of your power. Few people believe in gods these days, and that may weaken you, but if you really try hard, your true power just might shine through. But boy, there's sure been a lot of monsters around here lately. And that Mr. Orange you tossed around on the sacred deck looks like he thinks you're a regular wolf. Seems the gods have grown so weak people can't see them anymore. Aww. Oh, uh, anyway, I'll show you around the village. I have a feeling we're in for an epic adventure. This should be fun, Furball. Oh my god. Alright, let me find a save, and then I'm gonna switch it over to State of Decay 2 to end the night. Yo. So the good might come out of it right away. I know the gods aren't supposed to use these creatures in this manner, but... Oh, I almost forgot there was something... Oh my god, you talk too much. <laughs> the fans menu, you can check in the items you have, and there's other things you can do here too. Alright. Dude, that bug bouncing on your head, dude. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, so we have that Divine Retribution in there. Now, he's not here, right? Okay. <laughs> Can't say I have. I'd appreciate the ingenuity to... Oh, my God. <laughs> Let's not hit anybody with them. Oh, Spirit Globes. Okay. Humanity's Faith Made Solid. Restores little solar energy. Okay. Text heavy, I tell you, Joe. But reading is fundamental, and reading is fun. The more you know. Reading Rainbow? <laughs> Oi! <laughs> no, show some respect to your elders. Yo, I'm sorry, my man. Great Shirinui, yo, no. <laughs> Can we get him back up, please? No! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what was the speed thing? See, it's that loving animals can't resist. Let's not hit anybody with manhole covers. <laughs> Left it, <laughs> Yo, yeah, let's not, let's not, alright. Do I have to watch this whole thing? Mad long.
Hold on, it's saying something behind me. Okay. Yo, strike you bugging just cause it's Joe Yo. Are you sure about that? Yo, strike, dude, you're insane. What what? How much is it? 50, yo. <laughs> Strike, thank you for the 1508 bits. Fam, you are out of control. You are out of control. Oh, hello. Okay, there we go. That's what I was trying to figure out. It. We're gonna... I like the mechanic of like the paintbrush. And like how you have to like defeat the enemies, you can like end them in half with the paintbrush. So what is it? It's when they turn gray is when I have the opportunity to slice them in half? Yo, strike. Dude, thank you, seriously. That's freaking... You're crazy. You're crazy. Fighting went on for exactly 20 seconds. Damn, they're counting my fight? Let me at least get to the safe spot down here. That way we can start fire up State of Decay 2. Yo, can we get some love for Strike Up in the chat? Damn. Damn man's out of control. He's drunk. He's drunk, everyone. He's drunk. And... Oh, that's not the safe. Alright, I'm gonna go right here. There we go. Now we gotta save. Yo, that sword is huge. Jeez. There we go. Look at all that love. All that love for the cool bat. All right. We are gonna switch it up to State of Decay momentarily. And for the breakout video over on YouTube, if you enjoy what we saw. I like that I can do this now. Oh, I can just put my elbows right on the desk. I can sit here, have a normal conversation with you guys, and just like chill out like this. Be like, hey guys, what up? But. You enjoyed what you saw here. Give it a like, share it with friends, let them know what we do here. We play video games after work. I will see you in the next Nintendo Spotlight. Take care. Love y'all.